is a unique formation of rocks and the scenic sites that I am presenting to you in this video are the scenic sites, the unique landscapes of mountain that you will see here from the second viewing point of Jabal Al Gahar. All right, take note. Uh, listen to the way I pronounce the word Al Gahar, with emphasis to letter R. <laughs> well, uh, because you know that's how they pronounce the letter, the letter R, R. So this is Jabal Al Gahar. Now, as I said, uh, this is uh, the second viewing point I'm presenting to you. The scenic sites, the beautiful landscapes, and the formation of rocks that you will see from the second viewing point. The second viewing point is, you know, upon your arrival to the right side, that's uh, the first viewing point. While this one, uh, you will see uh, at the first viewing point, there is a rock wall to the left side. So this is uh, on the other side, uh, behind the rock wall that you will see to the left side. If you were standing at uh, the uh, viewing point, uh, first viewing point of Jabal Al Gahar. Now, this one, I would like you to see the cracks of the rocks. <laughs> well, it's amazing actually. So, you see these uh, cracks of rocks because Jabal Al Gahar, uh, there are, uh, I think, the biggest portion of Jabal Al Gahar is uh, composed of, consists of rock, sedimentary rock. Now, these are the members of my team with me here at Jabal Al Gahar. In my previous video, I did not say anything, but I would like you to know that the distance of this place from the city of Jisan is more or less 120 kilometers. Good for two hours a drive. Now, this place I'm showing you behind this red rock, that's the first viewing point. And coming to the second viewing point, you have to pass through this road that you see down over there, coming to the second viewing point. The uh, peak point of Jabal Al Gahar is one of the highest peaks of all the mountain ranges here in the province of Jisan. And so coming uh, to uh, this point, the viewing point of Jabal Al Gahar, I suggest that you bring a four-wheel drive car because although the road condition is excellent, but there are steep portions of the road that you have to deal on your way coming here. So I suggest bring a four-wheel drive car. Now guys, enjoy the scenic sights around here. I want to give you this zoom and shot for you to have a closer look to the cracks down over there. All right, this cracks may be uh, more or less uh, 200 feet uh, below uh, the surface I'm standing. And take note that still this is on top of Jabal Al Gahar. Just that uh, the altitude is lower than uh, the point I'm standing doing this shot. What is interesting is that in the middle of these cracks, you will find farms. And not only that, because I was told that in the middle of this portion of Jabal Al Gahar, there is a village. So the road that I have shown to you going down is the road that connects to the village. So right now, I am wishing and I hope that the next time I come back again to Jabal Al Gahar, I will be able to visit that uh, village. I am uh, quite intrigued uh, about the village. And of course, whatever I find in the village, I will share it with you for sure.